All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Squad Builder Stipulation. So if you guys don't know the rules, uh, we get a stipulation every episode where we have to build a squad of a minimum three nations, three leagues, a uh, nice hybrid squad, and then we have one of the stipulations, as you can see here. In a second, we're going to jump over to the random number generator to pick a stipulation, and then we will have to build the squad. If we fail the stipulation and go on to lose the game we play, then we will lose our best rated player from that game. Uh, so that being said, we do also open a pack to get our first two starting players. Um, and we will do that in just a second. But first, as I said, let's jump to our random number generator and get our stipulation. So we'll jump right over here. We will generate. And we got two. Um, at least two, five players must be under the age of 21. We actually did that in episode one. And considering this is just episode three, we are not going to do that one again. Um, and that also does mean the uh, five-star weak foot players, uh, or excuse me, four-star weak foot players are out because we did get number five last week. Go check it out. It is on the channel. But we do get number seven, which is four nations. Four nations must be included. So... We are going to jump in instead of a three nation squad, it is going to be a five nation squad. So I'm going to stop this recording, start this recording, and you should be seeing us jump into a pack. Special surprise, we are going to open a rare Electrum Players pack as well. And what the heck, maybe we'll, uh, we'll include one from there if we don't like our two rare gold players pack. So let's look at our two rare gold players pack first. Hoping for a board, as always. Don't get one. Uh, we get... Is it Sun? It is Sun! That's a really good player. Wow. Um, 82 rated, but a very good player. I'm looking forward to using him. Um, and we do have Diego Perotti. And you know what? We're going to throw out Perotti, because the one I have is actually a central midfielder. And uh, I kind of use him in central midfield. So we will just discard that Perotti. Um, and we will play Sun in the club. We will use him. And then we'll use um, whatever player we want, not from the BPL, uh, from this Electrum Players Pack. Again, no uh, side border, whatever they call that. Belgian striker? Batshuayi? Batshuayi. Of all the Belgians from Chelsea. Come on now. Just Batshuayi. Can't use him, obviously. We can't use... Ooh. Wow, a couple of Premier League players in there. But we will use uh, Matthew. We will use Matthew, a uh, Frenchman from the Portuguese League. And, uh, and we will use him. We will send all of these guys to the club. Um, and in just a second, I'm going to start the timer. Um, as you guys know, I collaborate um, with a few people talking about these videos. But, uh, but my dad actually had the su suggestion that we should... Um, not look at the timer while we're going we should not look at the timer um while we are doing the squad and i um you guys again can always time me at home i will let you know in just a second when we're about to start um and i'm not going to look at the timer you're just going to have to take my word for it um i'm sure you'll you'll be able to tell from my surprise when the alarm goes off most of the way through building the squad even and uh hopefully we do finish hopefully we do finish but uh you never know so we will look for human sun Premier League players. Oh, where is he? Oh, he's untradeable. Of course he is. He's untradeable. Human son. And we also decided we were going to use Matthew, which is in the Portuguese league. Let me get there. Let me get there. Uh, Liga Nos. Liga Nos. Matthew. There we go. All right. So, our stipulation, guys, if you recall is that we're using at least four nations. Uh, we've got two in Korea, and um, I believe it's Korean. Yep, Korean. And uh, in France, we must have at least three leagues as well. And those are our only stipulations other than everyone must be on full chemistry. So, in just a moment, I will start the timer. I'm counting down three, two, and one. Timer has started six minutes on the clock. And let's get going. So I think it's a pretty obvious choice here. Oh, God, I just got off Liga Nos. Um, we are going to use Rui Patricio. Uh, ooh, actually, we'll use Casillas. That throws in another nation already. Um, who do we have? Ooh, I like that. I like that, too. Um, and then we can use a Spanish central midfielder from the BPL there. 
Uh, this way we'll go. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. We'll do that. I like that. Um, and then we'll do not Pacini, not Pacini. Um, do we have any Brazilians going this way? Any Brazilians going this way? We've got Danilo, which kind of ties back into our Premier League theme. But how do we get another league in that way? I think we'll go with Danny Alves for our third league. And then we will use um, a Spanish player here. Oh, unfortunately, that's not going to work because of Grimaldo would not be on full chemistry. Oh, wait, there's more. We'll do this. We'll get rid of him, which does put Jardel. No, nope, we don't need Spanish. Now we need French. French, French, French. Nobody there. Let's look at concept players. Not transfer market, excuse me. Concept players. We may well use Sidibe. Uh, in fact, we will. We will use Sidibe. Um, let's look for another Frenchman from the French League. Ooh, maybe not from the French League. Wow, Paul Pogba would be pretty awesome, huh? Maybe we'll use um, maybe we'll use. Let's look from League on. I just had the urge to check the timer, but uh, <laughs> fortunately, I did not look. We will use Sansone, um, and then we will. You know what? We may just do something crazy. We may do something crazy, and use um, Kingsley Coleman who I believe I packed untradeable the other day. If we can get to him, all these people have Christian Pulisic's picture. If you look up at the card featured in the top there, it's kind of funny. Um, Kingsley Komen. Now he gets the two French links. Now we need a strong link here and a strong link up there. I don't think we're going to be able to do it because there's no French strikers from Spurs. What if we mess with this a little bit? What if we did this? Because there are French Premier League strikers, this might actually work. We will need a strong link there. So any Spanish Premier League midfielder will work here. Maybe someone like Ander Herrera. Maybe someone like... Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. David Silva, yeah, right. Um, we'll put Herrera in for now. And we will look at any striker who's French, from the, oh, Lacazette dream. Probably not going to pay for him, though. <laughs> um, oh, no, does it have to be Giroud, really? Oh, no, <laughs> I guess we got to do it, though, unfortunately. Um, unless we use a silver guy, but Giroud's just better than him. He's slow, but maybe we could play... Um, using the wingers off of him. So, I am going to look at the timer now because we are finished. We have two minutes to do anything else to our squad that we may want to do. Let us just double check. We actually have four nations. Um, <coughs> excuse me. There is a dominance of Spanish. Uh, Spanish. Wow. <laughs> Spanish and French. Excuse me. Uh, but we do have a Brazilian and we do have a North Korean. So, this is boring. This is a boring squad. Let's see if we can change it at all. Is there any Korean players that would actually be, like, usable? If I could find Korea. Is under K? Is this even where K exists? No. Let's try again. Uh, Korea Republic. There we go. Plenty of players. Not necessarily people that we're going to use. Let's look at... So obviously Sun is very much the highest rated guy. This guy is pretty bad. So unfortunately we can't really go North Korean, or excuse me, not North Korean, just Korea Republican. Um, any other formations that work? Because I don't particularly like that formation. That one's not going to work. That one's not going to work. I think we will have to go back to what we had. So we will go with uh, with this formation here. Yeah, I can't use this one because Sun will have full cam. We'll go with the 4-3-3-3. Uh, we will have to buy a couple of players, but we did build the squad successfully, albeit a little bit boringly. Um, and so because it's a little bit boring, I will put the highest rated player 
on the line. We will discard whoever. Um, I am going to stop the timer now with 27 seconds, so you guys won't get to hear the alarm. 24 seconds now. Uh, I will cancel that timer. Um, but I will t put on the line my highest rated player from this game if if and only if we lose the game. So I'm going to uh, stop this voice recording now. I'm going to go buy these players. I'm going to go uh, play the game. And you will hear my uh, my commentary over the game we play in just a second. So I hope you guys enjoyed this section of the video. And I'll talk to you in a all right, guys. So here we are. This is the team we're facing. A couple of footmas items. They also have human sun, but it's a pretty basic Premier League team. Um, Jesse Lingard does make some moves through our defense. Finds Andy Carroll of all people, and it's actually a really nice goal. Um, and as I promised, if we do lose this game, I will be discarding my highest-rated player. Um, but fortunately, we do come down and score a goal here. Uh, Kingsley Coleman working down the right side finds our uh, main man, Human Son, who somehow squeezes it onto the goalkeeper, giving us a 1 1 draw right now. Uh, but now we are moving through with Ander Herreras. Finds Son. Son finds Giroud. Giroud finds Son again, and he is able to slot it past the goalkeeper. I found Son brilliant. Um, and he's pretty cheap at this point in the game, so I, I definitely recommend you try him. Uh, really nice move from, from Giroud there. Uh, the 1 2, and then the shot. And then finally, um, we are able to make it 4 1. So no discards here. We had a really successful squad builder, and uh, and the guy actually quits right after this. So that'll do it for this episode of uh, Squad Builder Stipulation. It is the second, uh, the excuse me, the third episode, the second that we've completed successfully in a row. So I really hope you guys are enjoying the series, and I will be back next week, and I'll talk to you guys then. Thanks for watching.